I, well, I worked for MSU Extension for six years in Gratiot County as the 4-H educator and I am able to work with the traditional 4-H clubs and the county fair and our summer camps. Um, in addition, I get to go into classrooms and teach nutrition education. Currently, I'm the Project Red Chair and oversee that, and um, then this coming year, I will be the um, Promotion and Education Chair. Um, and I also sit um, on our Young Farmer Committee. I'm really passionate about Project Rural Education, and we um, in Gratiot County started last year our first um, red, Project Red Day, where we had close to 150 kids come um, from two schools on Double Eagle Dairy Farm um, in Middleton, and just educating um, youth about agriculture and bringing them to the farm to really see a working farm. And then this year we added uh, two extra schools and we reached close to 300 kids. And we just keep growing every year. So that is where my involvement and my passion um, kind of falls. And then I also do ag in the classroom and I love going into the classroom and um, just working with the kids hands on learning, um, helping them make the connection from the food that they eat and the articles of clothing that they wear to right, right back to the farm. Um, and, and seeing them light up when they kind of make that connection is really exciting for me. Well, I grew up on a Centennial dairy farm and was very involved in 4-H and FFA growing up. Um, helped out on the farm feeding calves and riding around with my dad. And then I went on to Michigan State college and got married and have two amazing beautiful little boys. Gunner is three and Gage is 18 months and now we spend a lot of our time back on Papa's farm. Um, they do the same things that I um, got to do when I was little and so that is just so important to me that they get to experience it and really understand the value of ag and um, you know, help raise them in the same environment that I was raised in.